that work? Uh, no, we still have green on. Okay, so what did you turn around? What do you need to turn around? Maybe... Oh, and what could you do? With maybe you put them on the opposite side. Ah, oh, try it. We got it. Okay. When doing STEM, it's important to ask purposeful questions, but what about when youth are struggling? How do we keep from just giving them the answer while still trying to keep them engaged? Watch as the frontline staff in this maker tinker space use question scaffolding. Using prompts that begin with I wonder or I notice before each question, the frontline staff builds on what youth have done and then helps them develop the next step through questions. Frontline staff are guiding youth to think more deeply about the STEM activity. So one thing, I notice that your copper tape is here and here. What can you do to the legs of your LED to make it touch the copper tape here and here? So that's step one of your troubleshooting. The LED was actually working. What else might be the problem? I turned it around. You turned it around. We checked the, we checked the polarity, and that seems to be working. What's the other component that we have under here? The battery. The no. battery. Well, did you check this battery? Do we know if this battery is actually working? OK, so the battery is working. All right, so let's put the battery back on here. So then what's the last thing? I heard some friends earlier saying that they had to do something with the rails. What did they have to do with the rails? Yeah, they had to press them really, really tight and make it smooth, right? So that's the last part of our troubleshooting here. The only thing is we need to make a gap right here. So what could we do? All right? What could we do to make a gap right there? Use the scissors. Yeah, so take this up. So, yeah. I just realized I have another problem. I don't know how to figure out how to, like, I'm trying to give us all, like, a little nose, like an LED nose. Okay. So that, that glows. Um, but... The um, placement of your LEDs. All right, so, so like, what can we do? How can we address this problem? You really want that nose in there, right? Like the prompt or something. Okay, well, let's try one first. Oh, no. I realized that if I'm holding it close, Oh, I got a hole. Yeah. You realize that if you got it cl if you hold it closer to the paper, it doesn't bend? Okay. So now we're going to flip this over. All right. And now you're going to have to move some of your copper tape. 